Welcome to Once Upon a Pipe. This is so far the coldest day of our winter season and just about every school in the state of Kentucky is closed. But I'm at work and that's a good thing. Uh, just taking a little lunch break here to explore a uh, new package that came in today Before I get to that I would like to um, make a reference to the last video that I posted that was a super easy method for quick pipe cleaning in which I mentioned this the ultra duster uh, if you look down in the comments SFK 1066 SFK 1066 noted, uh, is it really wise to take the stem off right after smoking it? I was always told not to do that and let it rest for a while before doing anything. Any thoughts? Uh, yes, I would agree with that. I, I would say, um, I think the pipe I used in that particular video was my so-called potty pipe. And I must confess that, um, Probably on this pipe, uh, I would not handle this the exact same way as a Dunhill, but this it just never gets hot enough to where that's any concern because I, I don't ever like fill this up and smoke an entire bowl in one setting. Um, however, let's take that advice to heart there from SFK 1066. So if you are just finishing your, your pipe, let it cool, let it rest for a while before you disassemble it and, uh, and introduce anything that would, that would, uh, change that temperature of it. Um, so thank you for that comment today, since it is the coldest day thus far, tomorrow promises to be even colder. Uh, I decided to pick a pipe that I thought could brave the cold weather, and so I'm going here with the simple Dr. Graybow freehand. I think this would get the job done. Seems like it would work well to me. Um, and today, I am smoking a combination of Larry's Blend from Hearth and Home and Orlick's Dark Strong Kentucky. Um, all right, let's get to this, this stuff here. Some Lane 1Q. Scotty's Trout Stream. I, I tried this and uh, this is excellent. Scotty's Bass Pond. I've never ever tried that. Hearth and Home 10 to Midnight. My absolute favorite. This is um, this is a 5 star rating for me. It's 5 out of 5. And um, it it is I don't know. It's just one of those things that um it works. It absolutely works. It fits well, smokes well. No complaints whatsoever about that. Um, somehow I ordered Trout Screen twice. I'm not sure how or why, but. I did. And this is another one. Um, more on the English side is Scotty's um, University Graduate. Uh, that is very, very, very good. Um, Scotty's Pancake. I've never had that before, so I don't know anything about that. And Sutliff's Cream Brulee. This, by the way, 
I somehow ordered just one ounce of it. And um, this is what it came in. The little small ounce. Look at the inside here. I want to show you this. See that? It's really, really sticky. Upgraded my uh, little tamper there. See, I added some things on there. You can see that. Love, joy, peace, patience, gentleness, goodness, and faith. That might sound familiar to some of you. Um, some of the Lane One Q. I cleaned out my old honey jar, and I've placed in here. So I'll always have this at the shop here. I'll just set this aside. Now, the creme brulee. This is what I want to get to. This came out. Let's see if I can just hold this up. See that? This came out extremely wet and syrupy, sticky, and um, so what I am going to do. I'm going to spread this out and let it sit for a while. Um, it is really messy. I'm not sure if that's the way it comes. Uh, if it was due to the freezing cold weather and it's been sitting wrapped up in a tiny plastic bag. Look how gooey that is on the inside there. Look at that. See how bad that's stuck? So, like I say, I have not tried this. And I don't know what to think of it yet. Um, I'm going to find another can or someplace to put this. But for now, I'm going to I'm gonna let it sit out. And uh, let it dry for a little bit. Um, it is way 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 too wet to even mess with I just keep imagining that all kind of stuff would be left inside the pipe if I were to stick that in anything right now so um, if you know anything about Sutliff Screen Brulee let me know I can't tell you one way or the other if it's good I just or want bad. to share that opening with you I will be um, getting into some of this a little bit later don't know if I'll do any videos of it but um, I am kind of uh, uh, curious to try the Scotty's pancake and the what was the other one I did not have um, the Bass Pond so Scotty's pancake and Scotty's Bass Pond we'll see how that goes um, I'm going to get back to work here. I need to clean this up so I can uh, finish getting everything done. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Please stay warm. Uh, and I hope that your pipe will keep you good company as well as the rest of the YTPC that is out there. May God bless you. And as always, thank you for tuning in to Once Upon a Pipe.